now let us study about fundamental units okay so in fundamental units we have three things that's length mass and time so first let's study what's meant by length what do you mean by length okay. length is the extent of something between two points okay i'll write for you what's length it is the extent of something between two points between two points so if you take any two points here like this feet for example then for this extent is or this uh, distance is called as length okay so let's see what is the assumed of length how to measure length okay so the assumed is we say meter Yes, unit is meter. The symbol for meter is small m. Okay. Now, let us see what's meaning of one meter. How to measure one meter? Usually, we say we measure meter with one scale only. But if we see, actually, we don't measure meter with the scale. We measure the light only. Okay. So imagine that we take a torch. Okay. Switch on the torch. Light starts from left. It goes to right. Okay. Light runs very fast. Okay. So one meter means the distance light travels in a fraction of a second okay see if you take 1 meter imagine this is one imagine this to be 1 meter so light will travel very fast okay in a fraction of a second so 1 meter means what is the distance light travels in a fraction of a second that fraction will see 1 divided by okay, this number like this side okay, of a second that means a fraction of a second light will travel 1 meter this is a fraction of a second okay so now we see this is a value for 1 meter. Now, we will see how what are the bigger units of uh, measurement okay, of length. So far, we see 1 meter. We have a kilometer and all. But now, let's see how to measure distance between two stars. Okay, between one star and next star. Okay. Or else, let's see, we will come to that a little later. We have different methods. There. Light year is there, parsec is there. Then, we have also astronomic unit. Okay. For example, we must see what is the distance between the sun and the earth. Okay. That we call as astronomical unit. Let me write it for you. So astronomical unit. Okay. So it is a distance between the center of the sun and center of the earth. So I will draw the sun here. For example, let this be the sun. Okay. And let this be the earth. So we have to take the distance between the center of sun and center of earth. This distance, okay, we call it as one astronomical unit. It's a distance between the center of the sun and center of the earth. Okay. So if you see the value for one astronomical unit, okay, it comes to be 1.496 into 10 power 11 meters. Okay, it's plus 11. Okay, it's a very, very big number. Okay. So that's called as one astronomical unit. Let me take a chalk here. So that is it. Okay. Next we will study what's meant by one light year. One light year. Okay. Now we will take a torch. Okay. Let me switch on the torch here. So light will travel. Okay. We know light travels very fast. And then we'll, light year means not time. It means distance. Okay. We will take time as one year. Okay, for one year, light is keep on traveling. It is traveling in space. Okay, so the distance that light travels in one year is called as one light year. It's a distance traveled. Okay, by light 